Coming to your love and direct from Now Valley Entertainment. What's up, boxing fans? TBE back at you again. Talking about that upcoming book, Spence Fight. Okay, let's let's take a look at this fight. A lot of people, I mean, I mean, I'm really surprised at you know what people are saying about this fight. I mean, you know, people that really should probably know better, you know, are saying that uh, Spence is gonna go to England, and take the title away from Book. I'm sorry, but I just don't see it. Uh, there's nothing that Spence has done to this point to where I could say that yeah, he's gonna be able to beat Book. I mean, I, I just don't see it. I mean, you know, uh, Porter couldn't beat Book, and I mean, Porter have you know a lot more experience than uh, than Spence, and I think Porter would probably be beat Spence. I mean, at this point in their career, okay, and uh, I would say the same thing about uh, Thurman. I, I mean, I think Thurman could probably beat Spence at this point in his career. Maybe later on down the line, you know, after he gains some more experience, he probably give these guys, you know, a, a beating. But at this point, right now, I don't think he could even beat uh, Porter or Thurman, much less Book. I mean, I just can't see it. I mean, you know, maybe these people are seeing something I don't see, but, I mean, I, I just don't see how it's going to be possible for him to do that, you know. Uh, and if you look at his record... You know, uh, he has the only people that, that, you know, only real name fighters that he has on his record that he has beaten so far is uh, Bundu and uh, Algeri, okay? And, uh, you know, I, I mean, I don't think that those two fights qualify him to be able to beat Spence. I mean, to beat uh, Book, you know? I mean, we got to be realistic about this thing. I mean, I know there's a lot of hype around Spence, and, you know, he's good, and he has some good potential. You know, that's what I see he has right now, potential. But I don't see, you know, that potential hasn't been realized yet. I think he's still, you know, a diamond in the rough. I mean, he's still got a lot of work to do. And, you know, it's. I mean, it's all good to say that that person is this and he's that, but he got to, you got to, you know, you got, he has to sh prove it. He has to show and prove. I mean, it's not good. In, it's not, it's not just to say, oh, you know, he can do this and he can do that. We have to see him do it. And uh, I just don't see him uh, beating Book under any circumstance. As a matter of fact, I'm, I'll go out on a limb and say that Book is going to knock him out, you know, or TKO him or something. I don't think, I think Book will stop him. You know, I don't think he can go the distance with Book at this point in his career. He's just not ready yet. Don't have enough experience and don't have enough skills. You know, I mean, I mean, to hear, you know, I mean, I even heard Dante, you know, Dante's Boxing Nation, shout out to Dante's Boxing Nation. You know, I even heard Dante talking about, you know, what, you know, that uh, Spence is going to stop book. I mean, come on, Dante, get real, man. You should know better. You know, I mean, I, if all the people out there, I think you should, you, you, you of all people should know better than that. I don't see where you're getting that from. You know, maybe you're getting some kind of promotion money from Spence or something like that. I don't know, or his camp or whatever, but I mean, I just don't see what you see in Spence to make you think that he can stop books. I mean, this guy went in the ring with uh, with Triple G. Book was in the ring with Triple G. And Triple G could knock him out or TKO him. Okay, so how do you think Spence is going to do it? I mean, I just don't see that. You know, I mean, let's get real, Dante. Come on. You know, uh, I can't see that, man. Uh, I mean, Book is a beast in the ring. You know, I mean, now we could look at his record as well and look at Spence's record and, and, you know, we could say almost the same thing about him as we said about Spence, but, you know, uh, that he doesn't really have a big any big name on his record. But he does have Porter and he does have uh, uh, Triple G, you know, that's one-on-one. -on -one. But again, uh, you know, uh, Porter is a top fighter in the welterweight division, okay, uh, who will give anybody trouble on any day. Anybody that goes in there against Porter and think that they couldn't slide by, you know, is going to get stopped, okay, or get, uh, lose, their, lose the fight. You know, you can't, you can't go in there half-stepping against Porter, okay? He, he'll take you out, okay? So he's a tough competitor, 
You know, one of the top fighters in the welterweight division, one of the elite fighters in the welterweight division. Okay, and uh, Book almost stopped him. I heard him many times, and it's only because you know uh, Porter's chin is almost as uh, probably just as tough as you know as Book. Why he didn't get stopped in that fight? You know, anybody else probably would have got stopped. You know, but uh, Porter got a good chin as well as good work ethic and, you know, good skills. You know, uh, he's a pressure fighter. He comes in all the time. And so, uh, you know, uh, Book wasn't able to stop him, you know. But, uh, you know, uh, I just don't see how people can think that Spence can stop Book. I'm not seeing that at all. I don't, in no way, nothing even close, you know, and I think that, uh, I, I truly believe that, uh, Book will stop Spence. That's, it's, you know, the opposite. You know, Book will stop Spence. I don't see, uh, uh, Spence going the distance against Book. I just can't see it. And, uh, you know, that guy, uh, uh Garcia's father, you know, he, he doesn't say nothing. He doesn't say much that makes sense most of the time. But one thing he did say, you know, that, that makes a lot of sense to me. And is that he thinks that they're pushing. Uh, he, he doesn't think that Spence is ready for book yet. Okay. And I agree with him on that. That's one good thing he has said. And that makes sense. You know, of, of all the, the stupidness he talks most of the time, that one thing he said makes a lot of sense. And I, I, I agree with him. I don't really see... Uh, that Spence is ready to fight Book at this point in his career. That they're rushing him too early. I know he won a championship and he's trying to go out there and get it by any means necessary, but I think he, he should have picked somebody else to get a championship from, you know. Uh, I don't think uh, Book is the right guy for that because uh, he's going to have to take that title out of Book's dead fingers, you know. And uh, uh, if we look at the, 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 you know, I mean, yeah, I mean, Spence has power. But the power that he has is like a cumulative power, you know, it's, 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 it's like a, you know, he, he, it's a, he builds it up. It's not like a one punch knockout power, you know, he, he just keeps pounding and pounding until he, you know, he overwhelm his opponent uh, with, you know, with, with his, you know, it's like a cumulative effect. After a while, he kind of just break you down. Okay. But I, you know, it's, he can break down Algeria. Algeria is much smaller than him. He could have broke down Bund because Bund is much smaller as well. Not that you know the size is that much of a, uh, a, a a difference, but it's just that the the skill set that these guys had, Algeria and Bundo, wasn't really up to the up to par to be able to to stop a guy or to you know compete against a guy like uh, a big welterweight like Spence. You know, he's a big, he got skills, and and he know how to use them to a certain degree. But uh, so. So Bundu, Bundu and, and, and Algeria just, you know, just couldn't put it together to be able to, 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 to take it to him. But believe you me, Book can take it to him and he will take it to him, okay? So it's a whole different, you know, people look at those fights. I mean, you know, the, the people that, that Spence walked through so far, most of these guys, uh, you know, well, those guys don't really, I mean, those guys are, you know, not really any kind of elite fighter. He didn't fight a, he wasn't a, 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 a triple G or a, or a, or a, a Porter, you know what I mean? Those are two elite fighters. So basically what I'm saying to you is that, I, I mean, I don't want to say that, that Algeria is a nobody or Bundy is a nobody, but you know, you know, for all intents and purposes, Spence hasn't really fought anybody yet. Okay. Or nobody in the elite category. So, we don't really know how good he really is until he fights somebody that can take it to him. You know, it's, it's one thing to go in there and take out these little guys that, you know, uh, you can just go in there and overwhelm them, you know, with your size and your strength and your, you know, your, your you know, but that's a whole different thing against going a guy your own size and a guy like, like Book. Okay. So I think Book would take him apart, you know, piece by piece. And I've seen, and I've seen Spence hurt before. I mean, like, for example, when he fought that guy, uh, what's his name? Larty. I mean, given that was only his ninth fight, but I mean, still, uh, people were still talking about him back then as if he could beat almost anybody in the world to it, you know? Uh, so he fought Larty and Larty hurt him. And Larty is not really a, you know, uh, 
an elite fighter either, but he he did come in there and he was, you know, trying, you know. So uh, now a guy like Larty could hurt him. And, you know, if, if Larty had a few more skills, he probably could, have, you know, he could have took him out if he, you know, but he just didn't have the skills. But he did, you know, I mean, I believe that there was a unanimous decision in that fight and that Spence won the fight clearly, you know, it was a clear win for him. No, you know, it wasn't anything like, you know, it was, you know, a split decision or he was a close fight. It was a clear win, but still, you know, Larty had his moments, you know, and he was given, you know, he went the distance. It was only eight rounds and uh, he was given uh, Spence some trouble. So... I, you know, based on that and, you know, the fights that I've seen Spence fight so far, just based on his record alone, I don't see anything there that says he could beat somebody, an elite fighter like like Book. I, I just don't see it. And for all those people jumping on the hype wagon talking about, oh, Spence, you know, yeah, I want to see it before I believe it. You know I mean? I, I you know, I want to see him fight people like Porter, like, 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 uh, you know, like, like one time Thurman, okay? Uh, you know, uh, some more, some more welterweights. You know, those are the two guys that come to mind right now because you know those are two of the better people in the in the welterweight division. But uh, Spence hasn't fought anybody to deserve the hype that I see he's getting right now. It's sort of like Triple G when he, you know, he was, <laughs> you know, all this hype, you know. So, uh, you know, a couple of years ago, you know, and when he hadn't really fought anybody yet. I mean, since then he has fought Book, you know, he has fought some guys, you know. But uh, the Spence hype wagon is out of control, man. You know what I mean? I'm not saying that Spence is not good. You know, he got skills. But he just doesn't have the experience or the skills at this point to beat a guy like Book. I don't see it, you know. And, you know, Book can crack. Book got power. You know, so I think Book would knock him out, you know, no questions, okay? That's a sure, to me, Book would knock him out, okay? And uh, I think that's exactly what's going to happen. It's going to be, he's gonna, if he doesn't knock him out outright, he's going to he's gonna stop him by TKO, okay? Or his, or his, or his corner is going to throw in, or, or Spence's corner is going to throw in the towel. I don't see him, he's ready for a guy like uh, Book yet, Okay? So for all you people out there that's on the hype wagon, the you know, uh, the Spence hype wagon, uh, you're gonna be severely disappointed if he ever faces Book. You know, uh, I think Book will give him a good beating and uh, and 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 stop him at the same time. You know, I, I see that clearly. He will. I, I'm gonna predict it. Okay, I'm gonna give people. You know, I'm gonna make my pick right now, and I'm gonna tell you that. If Book and Spence fight uh, in May, as they say, you know, it's supposed to be, I think that Book by stoppage, by TKO, probably around 8th, ninth round or before that, okay? So that's what I see for Book and Spence. I mean, Spence is, is good, but he just doesn't. He's just not ready yet for book. You, you know, he can't. I mean, you know, yeah. I mean, Triple G. I mean, yeah. I mean, Triple G gave Book some vicious punches, man. Book is eye socket, okay, and still could knock him out. And you try to tell me people actually believe that Spence is gonna knock him out? Come on, man. You guys are dreaming. Dante, you dreaming? <laughs> you in dreamland if you believe that. So, you know, I, you know, this is, I mean, this is ridiculous, you know, I mean, so you just go to show you the, how, you know, things get out of control sometimes with this hype business, you know, these hyping up these young fighters, you know, and so, you know, this is just another hype job, you know, at this point, not to say that, you know, Spence doesn't have skills, but against somebody like Book, I, I just don't see him winning. So my prediction is that Book by TKO around seven eight ninth round and that's what i see so let me know what you think okay and i will already know what most of you think you know most of you most of you you, you wagon jumpers <laughs> you hype wagon jumpers you know you probably think that you know you you believe all the hype is out there all these guys talk about book i mean spend 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 you know i just don't see it book by tko that's my prediction 
and that's what's gonna happen all right uh hit the subscribe button uh see you next time on the next fight analysis i'm out